Right now, a local pastor is trying to put a dent in a big problem with some small homes. Reverend Jeff Obamafi Carr is stepping away from the church steeple trying to help the homeless. Fox 17's Michaela Lewis shows us how micro homes are figuring in to Reverend Carr's strategy. Well, Scott, according to Nashville Next 2013 study, Music City's homeless population increased by more than 27% in a decade. The Infinity Fellowship Minister wants to build a village of micro homes, but it takes a village to do so. Dreaming about this, so to see it in real life, totally exciting. Many people wouldn't be as excited to live in a 60 square foot house, but Infinity Fellowships Minister is thinking bigger than this micro home. Maybe over a little bit more. Reverend Jeff Carr more. says homelessness is worth it stepping away from the pulpit. It impacts about 2,300 daily, according to Metro Housing and Development Agency. We are a congregation that is about action. Thinking outside the box meant creating one for those in need. Carr's college friend, Dwayne Johnson, is a general contractor and architect engineer. Oh, wow, we got lights. The designer built the microhome on a trailer in four days. Surprisingly spacious. It includes a Murphy bed, drywall insulation, AC, and soon a fridge and microwave. Technically, I mean, it is a microhome. Micro Looking at overseas and the shelter situation kept the face. So here we are, eight months later and we have a finished product. The work is far from over. It's a space that if any of us found ourselves homeless, we'd want to live in. I have to be willing to put myself in a position that other people all across Nashville might find themselves in. Carr will live here until $50,000 is raised to build a village. Reverend Carr's goal is to build at least six to eight or more. Each unit costs about $7,000 each. You have five kids. Yes, indeed. And you're going to be staying here. Yeah. How's that going to work out for well, you? Well, they, they're going to be visiting. My wife who's very supportive. There's a stigma that is attached to homeless people. A lot of people did not choose to be that way. So I just pray that people step up to the plate. The microhouse falls under trailer home reg regulations. Reverend Carr moves in tomorrow, and he invites the public to stop by and learn more. For more information on how you can help, you can visit our website at fox17.com. Michaela Lewis, Fox 17 News.